Hello there, everyone, and welcome back to Old World Blues. I'm your host, Mr. Mocha Lover. And right now, as you can see, we have just a gigantic mess on screen, which I've gone ahead and actually navally invaded to take out the Bellingham Union, and we actually pushed over from North Coover. Here are the casualties, 321, which is a pretty nice number, actually, versus eh, 5,400, so we're struggling here a little bit. I'm struggling here just a little bit. But we got to take out North Coover and have a good old time with these guys, with War Chief Kaya Ung. But we do have a couple comments to go through as well. What do we have? Passive refugee assimilation? No, thank you. Left tax on luxury goods? <laughs> Fat dreaming. Uh, propaganda efforts, war measures. Uh, actually, we can probably keep that one open because sometimes that can be okay to do. Political oh, political actions. Uh, we already have 100% stability, so we don't really need to see that one. Procurement things we can do later. Drastic measures. Do you guys ever use this? Let me know in the comments. Like, I never use this. It just doesn't seem very, very good. So, we actually don't get anything from that. Uh, ba ballot draft? You get 300 manpower? That's okay. But looks so bad. Let me know. Do you guys use that? Just oh my goodness. But from the source, acquire narwhal tusks from the source. Oh boy. Interactions. Uh, let's do some civvies because civvies are usually pretty good to do there. So, and let's see what happens over here. Hopefully we can take out North Cooper. We did. We do have a power arm over here as well. Oh, hopefully we can break through. You know what? Go ahead and come down here so we can get some supplies. That would be quite ideal. There we. Go. Oh, we're so close. We're so close. Break over here so we can get some supplies. Make sure these guys can't move. Uh, stop attacking. You guys go down there, and you guys attack right there. Hopefully, we can do okay here. Keep a lot of pressure on these fellas, because that's going to be super important. Especially when we're encircled as well, so. You guys stay down here, too. Up and up. There goes the bone dancers. Goodbye, dan those who dance with bones. And we're about to break through here, and about to break through down here as well. Awesome. We got some supplies. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Kill them off. Come on, keep going. Hey, that number's going up. We like it when the number goes up. Usually. Maybe except for our age sometimes. Sometimes. Not always, but sometimes. Cool. And if you guys want to, you head on over there. If you don't have chill wall, that's fine. Just take North Coover. That's the most important thing. And send in the power armor. Cool. Not bad. Uh, actually, you guys could probably sort of regroup over around here and just, just annihilate them. Even if we're not, like, super popular right now, that's okay. North Coover should die soon enough because they're literally losing a lot of organization. And since they can't reorganize, they're going to die. A couple comments, though. Uh, someone asked, what's a good uh, CPU? A good computer for uh, Hoi 4? Well, the most important thing for Hoi 4, you need is a good CPU. That is the absolute most important thing that you need for Hoi 4, just because it's very CPU intensive, because you've got to make a lot, a lot of calculations. A lot of small ones, but a lot of calculations. The GPU doesn't really matter too much, and a good amount of RAM. At least 8 gigs. Well, other than that, you should be more than fine. Uh, but yeah. Definitely a good CPU is worth investing in. And it's gonna suck so much. Oh, we took out North Coover. And we got him. Okay, cool. Awesome. Yeah, I, I, I beefed up my rig with a new CPU just so we can play things faster and I can process videos faster as well. But since they are done and defeated, and we have 512 political power, we'll do the kind tribe. Silex tribe minds its own business, as it always did. It didn't stop our ancestors from raiding them, and certainly won't stop us. Nice. Um, when can we change our nation? Because I'm pretty sure we can change our nation. Oh, we can send... Oh, look at this. 97 almost. New Victoria. Oh, we need to go New Victoria too. Oh, yeah. Alright, I didn't... Wait, why did this one get unlocked, though? Oh, Belling has to be accorded by us. We'll call it a unity. We need Silex, New Victoria, and Camlo. Oh, we could go with Camlo as well. Um, let's go Camlo first. Get rid of these individuals first. Uh, and then you guys, well, I'll just stay on there, that's fine for now. Uh, we have two armies, but we're going to probably switch you up a little bit more, just because power armor, power armor could lead the way pretty nicely. I'm going to take one, two, right there. And you guys go right there, because we got a lot of holes that we got to cover, which is totally, totally fine. Things happen. And we'll take one, two, actually just take one, because we only have so many divisions to spare, so. Take you guys, go down there, and then do something like that. Any holes here? No. We do have another hole, I'm sure, down here as well. Bingo was his name-o. If we're defending and entrenched, we should do more than fine. So go ahead and do that, guys. And when we get there, we're going to go ahead and train, because I'd rather have one mammoth front against the Silex. Or Silex. Silex nation. Silex. Silex. I don't know how to pronounce that. I just assume whatever it is. Uh, Marching fire is very nice. Uh, oh, I want to do that one still. Bug chief... Yeah, I mean, it just makes more sense if we do pain train for him. But no matter what, you already get this for every, every division. Just do that one. God dang it. Nah. Nah. Anyways, cool. Hit and run. Thank you. Our mongers are very cool as well. Compliance is quite well everywhere, except for down here. Resistance is going up, but... Hey, already 30% down there. That's where we naval invaded first, though. So. Through Bellingham, which was very, very bueno. 
All right, are we all where we have to be? Yes, please. Okay, stop training. And get ready to go, because we're going to make a lot of encirclements here, probably. The kind tribe, the tribal tribal remedies. The people of a Sialks, or Sialks nation create wide range of remedies and share them freely with traders and their neighbors. We should be able to easily put our hands on the recipes. Oh, I'll put our hands on them. That sounds very bad to say, but whatever. <laughs> I'll actually get you guys down here. We want you guys to move. You got, you got the, those legs. Them legarinos. Yeah, you, get, you send the infantry back. Because I'm going to take Veil, Mount, Cash, and encircle these two divisions. Just kill them off that way. Alright, let's go in. Now, they're going to attack us in a few choice places, which is very nice. You guys actually would probably do okay with this, perhaps? Yeah, you'll, you'll be fine with that. I'm not too worried about that. But send in the, the power armor and go bing-bonging down there. I'm not sure what bing-bonging really entails, but whatever. You guys keep them in place and have a good old time if you want. Ah, uh, screw everyone. Just go in. A few cow shoots here and there. Not too bad. We have quite a bit of manpower as well. Oh, we actually want a battle there. Look at that. Uh, hold on. How about other divisions? They're not... Those are pretty good divisions. Wow. And we still won the most I've had at any organization. Go, go, go. Go straight there and go up and kill them all off. God said, kill them off. And we shall oblige them. Other comments include, uh, someone kind of wishes that if only we could see a little bit more of northern Alaska, so we could see like the, the remnants of like the Chinese army and the American army and stuff up there. Yeah, maybe. I mean, maybe something that does include more of Alaska and the uh, Pacific Northwest would be kind of cool, actually. Uh, just to see what things would have been like up there. But we don't have that now. But maybe someday. Maybe someday. We're doing really well in the south, actually. 235 versus 800. Pretty good. They have 10 divisions left. Not too bad. Uh, other comments. Uh, also, just a general comment from me from all the comments I read from yesterday. I appreciate your guys' support and kind words. I really do. It's very nice reading kind words sometimes. Sometimes they're not so kind, but actually on this channel, they're usually pretty kind. Or at least the ones that YouTube approves of, so. Thanks for your support, guys. I do appreciate it. So, if you like to read about a song from the front, please go right ahead. I'd rather listen to the Ink Spots. The Yakuza Territories. Goodbye. Oh, God. I remember back in the day when there was a mod, a sub mod just for the Yakuza. That was so much fun to play as. I The Yakuza, that mod, I forget what it was called. I think it was part of the Alphabet sub mod collection for Old World Blues. It was such a fun sub mod. I love that mod. Was, uh, I wish, I hope to God someday that mod gets updated. If not already. It might be updated already, but the Yakuza Tribe was a lot of fun. Just. Lots of fun. Probably one of my favorite campaigns, but Ra Raider Stash? Camlo had no way of spending his immense fortune in this frozen wasteland, so now most of his stash is in our hands. Good for us. Sucks for him. Nice. Oh, flexible designs are very good for us, too. Uh, let's grab some more energy power stations. That'd be good. And we have to begin preparing for an invasion of New Victoria. That's going to really suck. But we do have a lot of ships. Why is the battleships over on the right side? Huh. Whatever, it doesn't matter. We're going to need some planes here. But we do have air base as well. Uh, 50... Oh, that's not bad. There you go. It might not help out that much, but do that anyways. And let's get ready to go to war. Raider stashes. Sign us up. Fold that money, money, money. And we should do relatively okay over here. Are we ready to go? Almost. Just go ahead and... Ah, pretty little Grand Chief Nkwala. Nkwala. She... Oh, yeah, she is female. Probably. Under her guidance, probably female. Uh, hopefully, she, never mind. I'm not going to go too far with what, saying what I want to say about that. <laughs> okay, anyways. Anyways. Power armor is looking very good. I love it. I love power armor. Any upgrades for the generals, actually? No, not yet. But we're doing pretty darn well. We've taken 43, 69 losses. Nice. Versus 139. Could be better than that, but whatever. Live up to 9 divisions. 160. Can we make it 200 before we capitulate them? Probably. Please. 72 versus 160. 164. Okay, that's not much of an increase, but whatever. Not bad. Industry is looking pretty good. Let's do that just for more resources. Uh, yeah, I'd like to help you out here, guys. Just go to Colville. You guys go right there. There you go. Maybe you can make an encirclement. That'd be pretty swell. Pretty darn swell, I'd say. And then you can help beat them up here and then really encircle them. There you go. Keep them in place. So we've lost, what, 120, 36, 445. The Hounds of Day are gone. Goodbye, Hounds of Day. Or Dai, Day. I have no idea. Eh, I can do that one. Why not? And, oh, we got, oh, we got him. Nice. Not that difficult. Cool. All right, so let's send in these guys. And begin to prepare for the invasion of San Juan Island with you two as well going to invade... Oh, well, we could pair drop. That would might uh, that might not be bad too. Orcas Island. We could go over there maybe. Uh, one, two. 
we'll go from the same area sort of here and do that that one two and these are eight divisions so we'll, at, we'll throw the power armor to you we could probably do okay naval invade uh, let's go there and then you we're going to take you and you we're going to take the power armor and the preschoolers together to invade nothing says a successful invasion like preschoolers and power armor there you go 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 ahead and you guys a lot of light ships not bad take this off and go repair what needs to be repaired hit and run nice all right so we need some walking tanks hit and run with the with the preschoolers ah <laughs> uh, we can do one of these we get more weekly manpower that wouldn't be bad and 300 more caps uh, i want to save what else we want i'm gonna save it maybe that's not bad yes. yeah i like lower resistance strikers but we're doing pretty darn well already so after that we'll do calls for unity all of old colombia is united under one state we must now unite as one nation too Cool. Well, it sounds like we get cores, but there's no guarantee that we actually get cores on them, but we'll see. Uh, let's see. There you go. Get them all on the line first. That'll be very, very boring. Oh, actually, all of you guys, except for you and you, head on over to North Coober. And half you guys go to Seshit, and actually half you guys go down to, like, Bellingham or something like that. There you go. How uh, do we poised to go? I think we're good to go. Let's try it. Actually, let's do this first. Our Navy's got to get in the water. Gotta get their feet wet first. Alright, we have a total of two battleships. And how many do these guys have? Too many. Uh, yeah, they have way too many. Uh, actually, before we do that, instead of convoy rating, convoy escorts. Or naval invasion support. Let's do that one, maybe. Queen Victoria the Sixth. Very good. And let's go to war. Can we immediately begin? Oh, no, we cannot. Do that. See what you can do. Maybe you can, maybe you can't. If they naval invade us, I'm kind of okay with that as well. Hmm. God dang it. God dang it. All but you guys. Take it off you guys and go there. Let's make a new army with that then. Fast Fingers Amsden? Amsden. Okay, cool. That's alright. You know what? Let them come in. Seriously, just let them come in. We can kill them off pretty quickly then. Go, go, go. Any upgrades? We're going to go through Inspirational 2. That's, uh oh. That's fine. Do that. I saw that uh, there was some sort of thing happened around here. Oh boy. Repairing? Uh, I suppose you could do that too. That's fine. What? Oh, uh oh. What happened over here? What happened over here? Oh, we lost a glider. That's fine. We did do a little bit of damage to him. Which means we're going to really have to increase the amount of. Uh, planes we do have especially in the era currently so you guys are actually going to go somewhere else maybe maybe go up there actually and do that you are going to duplicate yourself and do that down here too because while our guys aren't great they're still doing a little bit of damage which isn't too bad let's grab some of that too come on guys keep doing you're doing great Amsden fast fingers we like his fingers Part standardization. What if we went with air doctrine in this aerial warfare? We lost another plane, but that's all right. Whatever we enemies we find, we hopefully we can sink eventually. Oh boy! Well, there goes our ship. Just don't lose them. Don't lose them. Get out. <sighs> that would have been real bad. Oh, going to circle the divisions. That's pretty nice. And we're going to get naval invaded again. God dang it. It's alright. Let's finish these guys off first. And... Boom. And we've got them. Nice. Not bad. Do that too. Sash it. Go straight on in. You guys just go straight on in there too. Anything else? Oh, we're losing planes. But we got to be doing a good amount of damage, right? Oh, I hate fighting New Victoria so much. Oh, crap. There goes our navy. Well, yeah, that might be one thing I might recommend. I don't know if the devs are watching. I really doubt it. But can you maybe nerf New Victoria's Navy? There's nothing you can do about the Navy, really. So that, with what we have, and especially when we begin, there's literally nothing you can do with it. You can, there's nothing you can do about this. So that might be a little bit of a request I might put in for the devs. If they're watching. I don't know if they are or not, but just you can't do anything against the Navy. You really just can't, which sucks a whole lot. Uh, yeah, it's not bad. We just need... I mean, you can try to get a refurbished tanker, but you're out of supplies when you begin with, which really sucks. 
We can't even go. We can't even lower that. So, yeah, we're kind of screwed out of this then. Hmm. Oh, we actually needed. What the heck? Cool. Well, I'm glad they landed, but still. Yeah, the navy still is a big issue, massive issue. Uh, Bellingham is not looking too good. Yeah, well, at least we invaded. Yeah, just I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong about that. It's just whenever you try to take these guys out, it's just I hate doing this part so much. It's just so annoying. Cause New Victoria. Oh, I guess what? Eh, I don't know. We'll see what happens. I don't know. I just I hate taking out New Victoria because they're they're just a pain in the butt. Not that they're difficult. It's just, they're just a pain in the butt. But we got lucky. I'd say we got lucky. Because uh, Navy-wise, it makes sense for us to have a big Navy. But at the same time, we... I don't know. First, any, everyone, else, anyone else who tries this. It's not super easy. Especially if you don't remember to make planes early on. Because their Navy is pretty big. So... Yeah, we, we made it, which is good. But still. All right, guys, you're doing a good job, hopefully, over here. And guys, go on in. Yeah, you're not gonna let win over here, guys. I right, look at that. I mean, that is over. Well, that's almost 40 ships. That's roughly 40 ships. That's that's pretty difficult to beat, especially considering where we're at with this, with all this stuff. So, yeah, I don't know. Hopefully, someone else reworks the whole uh, group here someday. Go in, go in, just go in, come on. Uh, re reworks up. Uh, the Navy. I, I really hope that happens. I'm going to save this. I'm not sure which way to go. Army Recon, Army. Infantry is nice. Heavy Special Forces versus Army. 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 So... I, uh, just... I want to see what happens when we unite our nation first. So I'm going to wait to do that first. Uh, let's go down here, maybe. Command power. Let's get some better, better division recovery rate. Oh, crap. Did we lose our stuff here? Ooh. Oh, my gosh. We did. Wait. Did they take us... They took over our capital. Holy crap. How did we not capitulate yet? Oh, that's pretty bad. That's pretty... That's pretty... God-awful. Oh, boy. Yeah. I really hope New, New Victoria gets another update. Or, I mean, there was a sub-mod that... Gave you another nation to play as. Or update more for more content for this nation. But still, like... Oh, my goodness. It's fun. There's a lot of potential for New Victoria, so... Go. Go if you can. Please, 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 please. Yeah, especially when you don't have enough te naval technology, you got to force the attack. you got to go. There ain't no stopping us here. Are they... It doesn't seem like... I don't think they were doing last stand, but... Hmm. Alright, so you guys did okay. Why is attrition so bad? What the heck? Uh, break over here, then. Please break through these guys. Come on. I don't want to have to naval invade again. I hate fighting New Victoria so much. That's one of the worst nations, I think, to just to fight. Just because of the naval invasion stuff. Alright, let's go here as well. Kill that. I doubt we'll be able to do that well, but whatever. Maybe let's get rid of supplies, you friend. How are you not able to win? Okay, what's going on over here? Oh, my bad about technology. Uh, do, do naval warfare. That would be good. How? How? How much manpower do they have? A thousand? Which makes sense, but, like, come on. Can we not break these pieces of garbage? No, don't ask me for stuff like that right now. Uh, let's do that one. Get over there. There you go. Do that. Now that should put us a little bit over there. Go when you can. We need to go. And how are we doing with the repairs? Doing okay. Advanced generators are okay. We need more resource extraction gain, so let's do that immediately. Dedicated equipment would be very nice. And we're losing again. Oh my god, stop naval... I hate naval invading in Old World Blues so much. That's one of the things I hate the most, probably. And all the waterways and stuff. It's so annoying, man. Go, 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 go. Take the stuff. Take them. Find them and kill them all off. Seriously, just kill them off. Take the power armor cut them off completely. Uh, no, don't ask me for things. Go to Winter Harbor. Go to Campbell Floor. Golden Peaks. Take all the v VPs. It's VP season. V VP season here. Keep going, guys. Even though they take our stuff, it doesn't matter. Hopefully. No, 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 no. Uh, 
I need you guys to keep moving. Oh, never mind. Thank God. I, yeah, I don't know. New Victoria, I mean, if if you're not very experienced with Hoi 4, and, or at least Overworld Blues, I would probably not recommend this mod. <laughs> just because, I don't know, it's, it's so difficult sometimes. It's just so difficult with invading these guys. At least in the early game, even though it's already 2280, but even then, we don't have a lot of resources. You can't upgrade this, this too much unless you really rem know to, you know, upgrade these guys early on. And even then, this is, this is barely upgraded at all. Oof. Oof. Ironmongers. So, I apologize if I was feeling like I was raging a little bit. Which I was a little bit, but still. But still. Supplies should go back to normal. Everything should be back to normal. Yeah, we got Kung back. That's good. Yeah, hopefully not too much damage is happening. But we got 16,000 manpower. That's pretty good. In the meantime, let's build up some more civvies. Or millies, actually. Let's get some millies. Uh, one thing of millies, but really I want another thing of cities. There you go. Cool. Improved field rations. Reconnaissance. That'll, that'll be helpful for each battalion. That's pretty good. Not bad. And are we suffering from attrition here? It does not look like it, which is a very good thing. Total 27 divisions. Not too bad. We got a, well, That's a lot of money. 1,600 is pretty good. Uh, how about some settlements as well? Uh, you know what? Since we got so much PP, hunt down a bow head. The followers know. Uh, a whale, yes. Wait, weekly map our money? Sure, why not? Just because we can. Alright, so with the naval stuff, we might be actually done with the naval stuff from here on out. Uh, we've got some cyber implants we can do as well, which would be very cool. How do we get this one? Not researchable. Okay, then. Uh, let's get some of this. Better division training time. Cool. Alright, so with that in mind, yeah. Yeah, just naval stuff. Mm, not bueno. I don't know. I mean, don't get me wrong. I love doing naval stuff, but... New Victoria is just, uh, it's a place to be. And yeah, a, a call, another comment from yesterday is like, Enclave is basically the Bugclave, the Bugmen, which is from Fallout 2 as well, but library. Knowledge is power, and we like power. Another research slot, the Bugmen scientists become available as a research advisor. Old Columbia United. With most of our citizens being not only not Haydn, well, Haydn, yeah, but not also even from Haida Gwaii, we must embrace a new and inclusive legacy for our country. Although some disturbing rumors from the organization Bugmen came from reached our lands, Many people in the Isles and South still subscribe to the ideas of Bug Chief. One's about the new Columbia, which is destined to be the foundation for a new Pan American state. On the other side, many Northerners and Islanders still remember the land that they live on with American soil only for a few years before the Great War, and are more than willing to break centuries old American yoke and return to their true roots. It's also important that Canada is a native word, even though no one remembers what it means anymore. Bug Chief will show us what mean greatness means. New Columbia, capital goes to Bellingham. Changes to Washington W.A. Huh. Oh, changes his name, yeah. The Bug Chief becomes the leader of the People Party. Popular figurehead, radical reformer, stout defender. Oh, we annex broken... Oh, let's... Oh, we annex the people. Ah, we do get cores. Not... Oh, cores of the Heidetz Confederation. Remanifest destiny. Much faster just by World War Sons. And just by World War Sons on us. Where the age of rake is over. The time of leaves has come. Oh, we can basically from Canada. And do North Cooper. That's pretty cool. Prime Minister Kaya Ang... Does that economic know-how, stagnant politician, stout defender? Oh, that's pretty cool. You get stability. You get some just five local signs. Buck chief. I've got to do buck chief. Now that's pretty nice. What is that? Something on his head? Since his arrival to Haida Gwaii, the buck chief became one of the most influential people on in his isles. But only after the conquest of Colombia, he showed his true colors: red, white, and blue. Oh yes. Now I don't think we're in any sort of position to fight off. The Brotherhood. But we just... What can we throw on these whalers? Anything else? Fire teams would probably be good to get for defense. But, since we are this group, after we do the library, we get a whole research slot. Become available as research advisors. Advanced military engineering. Sounds like a lot of fun. Basic military engineering. And this focus is just beautiful. God bless us and no one else. That's really cool. That's very cool. Um, are you guys independent or allied to these guys? They are... Oh, they're allied. That's really not good. We're kind of stuck then with... What do we have? If that's the case, we're going to do this. We're going to need... I'll record everything. Almost. Well, we didn't core 100,000 people, apparently. What do we have cored? Oh, so all this inner stuff is not cored. That kind of sucks. Uh, New Victoria, are you cored at all? No, you're not either, huh? Well, do we get any... F Ooh, what's going on? Demand demilitarization. No one cares about that. Liberty reprimed. Core, no. Dedicated equipment. It's cool. No, so we have to manually core a lot of stuff then. Okay. 
All right, not bad, not bad. Get some more resource extraction, because we could probably use that. So if we have to core these things manually, that's fine. It's not great. Um, 800 is not really worth it. I don't mind getting some resources in for this first, though. Uh, it makes sense why we don't have this core, just because we're technically American bug men. So. Get some more energy. I like that. 68 is not bad. Hey, more division is nice. Good. That'd be very good. And these bugmen. Uh, eventually, we might be able to edit our templates, but we'll see what happens. After the library, what have we found? Making sure that you have at least 10, more than 10 civilian factories available. Oh, I'm, I'm going to have to cancel that library. That's cool. Well, aerospace engineering. Let's go with electronic engineering. We've collected enough material in electronics engineering that we've created R&D department to focus on this field. Hey, a fourth research slot. Nice. Now, we can't go that far, obviously, with all our stuff. Let's get a barrage balloon just in case, because it seems like we could probably use that stuff eventually. Let's get some more reliability as well in the meantime. As we're just kind of building ourselves up. Cool, cool, cool. And also, I did ask you guys yesterday, what should our name be for our special intelligence agency? And it is going to be the unreadable string. Ooh. Well, the secret whales. There you go. Cool. And I'm going to keep that icon there just because it's unique. It's not a whale at all, but I just think it's unique, and I, I really like that one. So, uh, In the meantime, let's go ahead and put some people near Seattle. And uh, what was it? Wenache? Wenache? Cool, why not? And there goes parts of Mexico. Very cool. Remanifest Destiny? Actually, oh. Like the Americans of the old did from the east to the west, we shall reclaim the whole American continent from the Pacific to Atlantic coast by the right of our manifest destiny to overspread and to possess the whole of the continent which Providence has given us for the development of the great experiment of liberty and to federate itself government entrusted to us. Nice. Some more defense, too. Well, I'm not sure what to do with my PP, but I know what where to stick it. Just going to do all this stuff. I don't want to have any more resistance or stuff like that up here, so... That's going to cost us a lot. And is it worth doing it all this stuff up here? Probably not, but whatever. Less resistance sounds good to us. And slightly more resources. Not very much, but that's alright. And we're now out of PP. Alright. So, Renetics Industry. Just keep doing a lot of this stuff. Because we could probably really use it. And you guys will go with... Uh, it's always good to do guns. Barrage balloons, we're kind of okay. Uh, basic. Eh, get some more advanced power armor. I love power armor. We all love power armor here, hopefully. Because if you don't, that's a sin. You must love power armor. Ah, oh, another battleship. Good. This is not good, but it's not bad. And, you know what? What have we found? More than 10 civilian factories available. Well, I guess we do that one. Under Bellingham, there's a bunker, and in this bunker is something glorious. Let's do that, and if we really need all the extra stuff, let's just go ahead and do that then. I'm going to just leave 10. Um, by the 4th, we should have at least some of that done. So by the end of this, at this advantage, make sure you have at least more than 10 civilian factories available. Under Bellingham, there's a bunker, and in this bunker, is something glorious. I really want to know what's under here. Anything else? Oh, modernize our electronics as much as possible. Sophisticated electronics technology? What is that? Okay, we'll do that one. That sounds good to us. And now we have 25,000 manpower only on wide wasteland militias. So overall, we only have some areas here that need to be recorded, and that's it. And New Victoria, but whatever. Uh, we have a total of 32 divisions. Not bad, actually. That's not too bad. So next text we'll do, we're going to come over here and do some saws. Yeah, get some saws for infantry. Fire team platoons will be very good. And more light cruisers. Thank you very much. We got a lot of war support and stability. Reinforcement rate, less division attrition. Oh, I'll get some better reinforcement rate, why not? Yeah, that'd be okay. That'd be okay to do. Uh, we're getting saw, so that's good already. Um, keep one on that area, that's fine. Keep you guys over here too. That'd be kind of smart to do, probably. Get some more planes for you guys as well. That'd be good. Ooh. Adobe housing is very good as well. Vehicles, robotics, tribal stuff. Uh, anything up top? Let's just do the terrain knowledge, why not? Who knows how long we're going to have this tree here, so... You never know. And it's almost done. Actually, because it's almost done, I don't mind having some cities. I, it says we need at least 10, so I'm going to risk it and not build anything right now. So we have how many cities free? 10? 11? So 
I can't even tell, so it doesn't even matter. Rolls Cove is almost done, and with this many civvies, literally at least ten, the repriming liberty. Before Alaska was reclaimed, the Pentagon ordered a giant death robot, which is supposed to be a joint project between the two rival companies, Robco Industries and General Atomics. It seems that Robco was not a big fan of sharing their project, so they began creating their own Liberty Prime in the secret bunker below Bellingham, with a key premise that they would be able to finish him faster and make him better than the one in the Pentagon, and because of Bellingham's northwestern location, sell him on better terms to the U.S. forces in Alaska. And for, unluckily for them, the USA reconquered Alaska and pushed into China without any giant death robots. Because of that, the almost finished prototype, just needing a recharge for its batteries, was sealed off in an underground silo where he stayed before and after the Great War. Until our scouts found him, of course. And now the question arises, what should we boot him up with? Should we boot him up? Yes. Oh, heck yeah. Repriming Liberty? Yeah. Heck yeah. All right. Liberty reprimed. Well, I guess we gotta wait for that. Well, it seems like there's not much here to do. So I'm gonna read through this and uh, get through some of this off screen. So we have collected enough material on civilian engineering that we created R&D department focus on this field, in which we'll also probably do naval engineering. We've collected enough material on naval engineering that we can create an R&D department focus on this field. As well, seems like basic military engineering, as well as advanced military engineering, which is basic, okay. And aerospace engineering as well. So I'll see you in just a little bit. All right, everyone. So here we are in 2023. Quite a while ahead of time right now. But I've literally just been sitting here allowing the AI to attack our lines against the Western Brotherhood just because we really need to let just let time go on. But we've killed off 60,000 enemies, and uh, we're doing okay. Now, a lot of things have happened. Apparently, the NCR just killed off and demolished the Legion, which was kind of surprising me. The Texan Brotherhood over here. Oklahoma's here. Mexico went a little crazy. Uh, I guess I haven't even paid attention. The two main Mexican sons have taken over a lot of Mexico, except for the Second Second Mexican Empire. New Canaan actually had just had a civil war, and Gorgonia's doing very, very well for themselves. So, it's been a while since I've seen you guys, or at least, you know... Oh, maybe you guys see me just recently, but I've been just sitting here, kind of playing, just kind of waiting for us to be able to take out these guys, because it's taking a while, but that's a probably bad idea, we're going to do a general attack. Now, technology-wise, at least speaking, we have been able to do everything except for Liberty Reprimed, just because we need to actually do this one, but it requires caps. 240 caps is a lot, and since we are at this point in the game and unlocked a lot of technology, we can do some R&D, where we have to get more caps, and we'll add technology, which I've been doing a lot of technology off-screen, including all this stuff. Eventually, we do have the schematics for the fighters, but we need jet engines, so yeah. Cool, let's see what we can do, just because I'm, I'm, I've am i been playing this for like at least an hour or two off-screen, so I hope we can do well. Obviously, right there, we didn't do quite well, but at this point, I just can't imagine these guys holding on for much longer. They have less than a thousand manpower. These guys have actually quite a bit of manpower themselves. That's actually quite a bit. Which is not very good for us, but you know it is what it is. Whatever. Uh, you guys, hold for now. Hold. Don't move. Don't leave. We want it. We're gonna kill a lot of soldiers off on this side, but it's gonna have to be worth it, just because. Oh, we got an operative captured apparently. So it does suck fighting over here. It really does. Now, once we break through here, it'd be so much easier to break through everyone everywhere else, just because we have a lot of power armor. I converted all special forces to power armor. Also for the land auction, I've already gone ahead and finished off purity, just because. We like being pure, I guess. With it, if you're playing with at least some bug men or enclave guys, I feel like you you just kind of got to go down that route. So, cool. And we're almost out of uh, stuff here, energy cells, which is very very bad for us. So that's not good. 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 Oh, there's an open hole here. But hopefully we can beat the crap out of the Brotherhood as fast as possible. They got 57 divisions still, which sucks. But a hey, it is what it is. Please don't come over here, guys. Please don't come over here. We really don't want you over here. And we got nine days left of energy cells, which is very very bad. So we're gonna take you guys and say. Hey, go home. Irrigation is nice. And we're trying to get as much resource extraction as possible, but it's taking quite a while. Let's do some more research speed, shall we? Yes, we shall. Keep going, keep going. Actually, how much? How many airplanes do they have? They have quite a few planes in the air. Barrage balloons, which is not very good for us. Let's grab some jet engines and do some of this. More power armor. Great, we're out of energy cells almost. We're so close to running out of energy cells. Not very good. And I know we could build more of this stuff, but it just takes so long to build. Oh my goodness. And I've actually court a lot of stuff off screen too so here you go i've got a lot of stuff off screen um over here this has no energy that's all right this has no energy as well god dang it where is the energy cells there's really not a lot of energy up here is there there really isn't uh even a smidgen more please i'll take a oh there you go yeah, smidgen thank you well now we're out of energy cells which is very bad that's why we still want to use some sort of infantry. Not too much, but just enough to get us to where we need to go. A40 division still, which kind of sucks, but whatever. You guys head on over to here, because you're just going to be 
just very heavyweights for now. Just kind of hanging out. So, yeah. As long as we can take out the Brotherhood, that's the most important thing. I just want to kill off the Brotherhood. Brotherhood has to die. No one likes the Brotherhood. Especially since down here, they're dead as well, so. Let's get some of this too. Plans are very expensive. Oh my goodness. They require 1,400 things of energy. Oh my gosh. If you heavyweights could just, like, move your power armor without energy, that'd be great, but... Oh, please don't get in circle. Please, for the love of God, do not get in circle. Do not get in circle here. That's better. These guys have got to be out of manpower, because I've been doing this literally for at least three hours. They might be mobilizing more, actually. Wow, how many things of that do we have? Wow, that's quite a bit. Uh, do we lose planes? No, that's good. Oh, we can do some of this. Spec Ops stuff. Ooh. Let's go ahead and repriming Victory Prime. Charging and booting up Liberty Prime as a lengthy and costly process. But, <clears throat> at the end it will give us a giant death robot. Nice. And exploitation methods? Sure, why not? And actually, since we have so much PP, we're going to go ahead and hunt down a Black Whale, Gray Whale. Division attack? Yeah, let's get that one. I want more division attack right now. Because we're doing relatively okay with it. Hey, more duckyards. Good. Get some more of that. There you go. And jet engines will be nice. Let's get some Xion fighters. I love the Xion fighters. Okay, that actually took... That was so much less time than I thought it would take. Nice. But now we have a lot of areas to take over. And I actually raised our conscription level by one already. Just because I thought we needed more manpower. And we really did. Because we lost like five, 6,000 people. Oh, those energy cells are looking so good now. Oh my goodness. Bugmans. Name came from dragonfly-like appearances, other PA and flying machines. Our AF, R&D, should look into vertebrates which we possess, and the wrecks we managed to acquire, in order to recreate their blueprints. Nice. And sop us, sop sop? Oh, give us that energy, please, for the love of God, give us that energy. But now, since we are here, and we can do quite well, let's go and take out the Timberline, because we can. 13,000 manpower is quite a bit. 10 days, that is an extremely short amount of time, which I love, 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 love. Actually, this point, you guys go over here, too. You're all just infantry, which is fine with us. We will remove you guys eventually, but give us some time. We will. And we'll go to War with Gorgonia next, probably. I just want a bigger front line with those guys. And let's do something like that. We can slow down time just a little bit. And actually, because we had we took so long with everything here, um, our divisions, our, no, our ships are actually very experienced at this point. Our leader actually has, like, a lot of experience. Let's go look. Do we have another... Battle crew? No, we have no command. Oh, you guys keep doing that for now. Let's not actually do that. You guys can't do that. He's Lunatic the Joker, level skull level 5. He's uh, a fleet protector, a superior tactician, a fly swatter, as well as a cruiser captain and searching pattern expert. Very nice. So not too bad. Could be better, but not too bad. We just made four more ships. Great. After that, we'll go to War with Gorgonia, because why not? Yeah, because I'd rather do that Heaven's Gate next. And by next, I mean later on. I don't think they'll stand too much too much against us. Not bad. Casualty ratio is pretty good so far. Could be better, of course, but not too bad. Could be better, though. Could be better. Could be much better, actually. But that's alright. And actually, I stopped making divisions because it was costing us quite a bit of money. Alright. Fabrication factories are done. Let's grab some scrap shacks because we can. More divisions. Oh, no. I didn't stop making divisions. Oh, okay. That's good. Whatever. Nice, do that. And you guys come over there, too. And one, two. There you go. That should be good enough. Yeah, I think that should be good enough. Economic resurgence? Thank God. So we can get some more money now. Oh, finally. We have a lot to build, but we'll do that off screen mostly. So, I do want to ask you guys your thoughts. How far should we go for this campaign? Obviously, we've got. Basically, Enclave technology, or we're working towards that goal. We've got some digital data links. Let's grab some more Zax technology, because it's already this far ahead in the game. So let me know how how far we should go. Because at this point, since we don't have to fight over too many mountains, um, taking out more enemies should be much faster, just period, overall. So that'll be actually very good for us. Very, very good, because well, we don't want to be stuck anywhere. Let's go on in, though. Actually, hold on. How are you getting defeated? How are you getting... Well... What the heck? They're actually coming back out and expanding against these guys. That's kind of impressive, not gonna lie. Too bad, I don't care. 
Nice. Damage, 6,000. She only still lost more, though. But not bad. Well, technically, we've killed off about 700, 800 of them. Make that 2,000, or 2,500. Really. Robot extraction's nice. Pre-war housing? Why not? Sounds pretty good to us. Shush 22. As soon as we're done with this war, we're going to go straight into war them as well. Is this oh, the fight against NCR is going to be god-awful. I can only tell. Uh, we'll go to war these guys next, because we can. Non-stop war. And we can get plasma weaponry and gauss weaponry, but we need sophisticated infantry tech, so... Small arms? Yes, please. Oh, we're making a lot of money every quarter. That's really good. Nice. And over here, Seattle, can you go to Nossus, maybe? Cool. Uh, we'll go there. Electric City. There you go. West Portland. Uh, we need more political power. That sucks, but that's, that's, that's fine. 205 is just really, really good. At this point, I don't really care about technology too much. Uh, we went with electronics for this time, so let's go and grab some more power armor stuff. Because we love it. And how much damage have we done so far? Oh, actually, we can do this one. Liberty Reprimed. God bless us and no one else. More divisions? Cool. We should be able to do pretty darn well no matter where we're at, so... We lost 400 versus 1,000 of those guys and 19,000 of them. Not bad, not bad. Could be better, but whatever. Temple of the Gorgons is going to fall very soon. Hey, we got it. Thank you for playing and kill off the Shoshone now. Uh, the infantry should be able to handle this probably, maybe, hopefully. There you go. Send so four divisions over here. That might be a bit too much, though. Ah, Liberty Prime. Liberty Prime is online. All systems nominal. Weapons hot. Mission: the destruction of any and all Chinese communists. I feel patriotic for every country that doesn't even exist. Nice. And actually, it's not that good. Uh, I've already kind of technically I've already put this once, and I didn't do so well earlier just because I struggled against the Washington Brotherhood. But you don't need to see that because I've already deleted the footage. So, anyways, uh, you guys go over there, and you guys do that, and then do do. And then you guys go do that. God, there's, there's just way too many boards between us and these guys. I don't like that. Alright, let's keep going. Keep going. You're doing a great job. That would help if I gave you stuff here. Keep going. Keep going. We've only killed off 3,000 of them. Ah, we're not there yet. We're definitely cutting a lot of these guys off, though. It's pretty good. We're housing. Do we get something else here done? We could hunt down more people, or hunt down whales. That may not be too bad. Hey, more power armor. We love the power armor. Yeah, we'll leave a giant open a hole down here, so that'll be fine with us. And I've only cut nine to 10,000 of them. Is that all? I guess so. But I do like it that you don't have to... Uh... Oh, look at the 80s. They're looking pretty good. Nope. Um... You're not given everything right off the top, which I think is a pretty good mechanic for the game, so. I'm gonna go to war by when? May 12th in about like five days or so? That kinda sucks. We can redo this. It's only ten days, so. Not bad. Not bad. Hey, Zach's technology digital decryption would be very nice. And you guys go whenever you can. Three more Oh baby. I think having eh, you know what? As much as I want to say we only need this many armies. Hey, Rocco's Liberty Prime. Level 7 attack and defense. But you only can have 5 of them, which really, really sucks. So, he's level 1 too, so. He's a death robot. More attack, more breakthrough. Army unit leader size minus 15% maybe? So, that kind of sucks. That actually really does kind of suck, so. But it is what it is. Actually, let them run into you and then we'll attack them again. See, look at that. That's beautiful. Just attack, attack, attack. 8,000 is going to drop very heavily, hopefully very soon. You guys don't need to worry about attacking. Don't worry about it. Hang out. They're going to flood over down here, which is going to suck, suck, suck. And now, let's see if we can go in. Now, we're not going to win everywhere, obviously. But we'll win in enough places that it doesn't matter. Nice. Losses. We're going to need more energy. Oh, wait. That's kind of glitch now. We're going to need more energy cells, too. Uh, overall, like we should be doing extreme amounts of damage. Eventually. 
down here. We're actually losing the territory quite quickly. But since we push into here, we should do okay. Fight him, fight him, fight him. Kill them all off. Seriously, kill them all off. There is no retreat. Just is what it is. Actually, that division might die. Eh. Alright, so you guys are good enough. Keep going, keep going. They cannot keep some. Oh, good! Massive radiation leak? We are making so much more money. Restore the Nasui? Cool, we'll do that one. Oh, they must be mobilizing more, but they lost at least 20 divisions so far. Good, go, 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 go. Kill every single last one of them off. There's no way that we have mixed here. I mean, we're just, we just have too many guys, and our t plane technology is just too good compared to where they're supposed to be at, so. Oh, no, 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 no. You guys got to keep attacking. It's all together for victory. Keep going, guys. Keep going. Oh, get the fighters. Get those attack planes, because we can. Oh, yeah. Oh, we need more energies. Oh, we need some more stuff. We can actually upgrade these guys, too. That wouldn't be too bad, but our liability is there is really bad. Uh, we get less agility. I don't want to do that. We're going to max that out. That's good enough. There you go. Not bad, not bad. They should be dying faster than this, though, honestly. Like, this is kind of pathetic. Advanced power armor schematic seems pretty good. Ro modernize the robots as much as possible. Let's come back over here and do some of this. Better reinforce rate. Come on, they've got to be losing more than this. How many have we lost? 9,000? That's kind of pathetic, I'll be honest. My soldiers are kind of pathetic. Alright, let's get some radar as well. Come on, keep going, keep going. Don't give up the fight. We're not done yet. I'm actually going to probably do this instead, actually. We're going to hold because these guys are expanding way too fast down here. So you guys do this. You hold and you fight down there. You guys come down here, reorganize yourselves, and then go ahead and do whatever you need to do. Nice. Keep going. Don't get encircled. Don't get encircled. And once we get all the infantry down, moving around, we'll be fine. Because they're definitely mobilizing more. They're absolutely mobilizing more. There's no way that they're not. <clears throat> I just saw they got 700 more manpower there. 8.3s are going to jump back up, probably up. 8.7 again. Yep, they are mobilizing, so that's unfortunate for us. Oh, well. Get another Great Wall because we want, or Great Whale, just because we want more money. We need more money anyway, so. That'll be alright. That'll be okay. Please do not die here, guys. You have a duty and a mission to do. And over here, we're going to... Oh, we already have... Ah, pretty good here. Not bad, not bad, actually. Cool, there you go, too. The victory for all new Cumbl New Columbia. Don't you love it when the AI just keeps spawning more and more men? I really wish that this mod will let you know what, if you have enough intel, what level they're on for... I think you can see their text, actually. Um, conscription. It doesn't make any sense why you can't see it. I need you guys to attack. We should have absolute air superiority because we don't have so much energy right now. Maybe I'm wrong. But we, and we can see infantry attacks. Oh, we can literally see everything that they have researched, which is actually really cool. Actually, can we see the land doctrine? We can! They actually went trooper warfare. That's kind of cool. I never knew that. That's actually really cool. Oh, look at all the... They, they are sophisticated. Oh, wow, look at that. That's kind of cool to see. But nonetheless, they're all going to die. Clementian operative, huh? Well, all right. Ah, and a circlement. We love those. All right. Keep getting them big boys. That'll be good. Nice. Anything else down here yet? Nope. That kind of sucks. We have a lot of PP though. Lots of PP. And after that, uh, are the 80s allied or... The Mormon alliance. The 80s New Canaanites as well as the White Legs. No, just... Oh! You're the Apostles! Okay, that's interesting. That's different. Let's grab more Heart Attack and Piercing. That'd be good for when they have really tough guys to beat up. Keep going in. Don't worry about it. Man, beating up Heaven's Gate. I want to see the casualty ratio for all this stuff. Let's build some more of this stuff, too. We could really use this. 
Alright, so we cored off a lot of stuff up here. It's not really worth coring, honestly, at this point. We're Washington, Virgin Virginia. Washington, Washington. This will be worth coring. Oh, look at that. Now it's definitely going to go up. That's good. Well, now it's going back down. Okay, this is weird. This is a weird timeline. we go do that. And this isn't cost too much. There you go. Sophisticated infantry tech. Economic researchers is good. Now we need more PP for this. God dang it. Modernize some plasma rifles? Well, get, let's do that one next. Uh, radar, why not? And let's go back to travel tech and do some of this. More reliability? Why not? Oh, they're coming back to you. Well, too bad they're all going to die all the way over here. I feel like we were just over here killing off the uh, fine folks of uh, the Shoshone Nation. Yeah, it sucks that this guy can only get up to four power armor units. I mean, what the heck? How deep do we have to go into your territory to kill you off? What the heck? I mean, they have literally 110. They have how many? 54? They're literally less than half of how many divisions they started with. So that's good and all, but still. Doing this is taking forever, but that's usually, that's just normal Heaven's Gate. Oh, crap. Heaven, oh, my goodness. That's not good. What do you mean you want to go to war with us? We're busy right now. We're busy. We have enough manpower and supplies and equipment like that, but please just kill them all. Please take new Nicaea. Please, for the love of God, go, 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 go. Oh crap, that's not good. We're not ready to fight the Mormons yet. <laughs> Guys, please go in. Please just kill them off. For the love of God, please, please, please. New Nicaea. Oh, we got him. We got him. Right before these guys want to kill us off. That's good stuff. Alright, so, how are we going to do this? Hmm. You have too many divisions. That sucks. That really just sucks, man. Out of the Bug Chief, though. We did go Pain Train, so that's good. Savage Leader. We got to go that way. And you are going to be the by Winston Brody. Pain train yourself as well. Cool. I think putting 15 divisions here is just too weak. I'm going to put all of you guys on this line. So that should be okay right there. Uh, you can't really get down to that part of the line, so there you go. Um, I think we're going to have to manually divide these guys up a little bit better. So we'll do something like that, maybe. You guys will come over here and do something like that. I'll cover the rest of the line like this. There you go. Because you guys will have to come over here and then cut you guys down in half and go right there. And do that. And then you guys go right here and then do that. That should be okay. I could be very wrong. But we'll see. Get some more supplies here just in case. It's going to be very bad. It, just, it, oh, it always is. It just always is. Oh, we forgot to do this up too. Yes, yeah, we have enough money. Why not? Okay, not bad, not bad, not bad, not bad. Vertebrate. Oh yeah. Let's get some Gauss weaponry because we can. I forget which one's better. Defensive online. Very good. We get hold ten fighters. Wow. We're really lucky. We got ten fighters. These guys don't want to go to war with us. What are you, bunch of pan? Oh, they look how many allies they have. What a bunch of pansies. You don't want to fight some power armor? What's wrong with you? Ooh, supplies are really bad. Combine AT Doctrine. Let's grab some more command power increase. Why is it so bad here? Is it because of supply? Hold on, let's take a look. Oh! Now they're going to war with us. Now we're holding some. You now supplies just bad in general on here at, near Idaho. There you go. As long as... Oh, they're actually coming through here, huh? That's not good. Well, you want to do that, we'll kill you off then. Who knew by the second episode, we'd be all the way deep in uh, Utah. I, for one, did not. Go in. Seriously, just go all in. She attack planes. Let's grab some more range. That'd be very good. Oh, tr oh I gotta go transfers. I gotta get them gunshiperinos. Which one's better? This or vert gunship? I think gunships are technically better, but that's alright. Inherit mechanical knowledge. Let's grab some more resistance strength in our own country. That'd be good. Nice. As long as you can hold, that's all you need to do. There you go. That's all you need to do. Even infantry is doing okay. Oh, I wish we could see how many losses that we've taken and have, uh, they've taken. Actually, we could kind of still see that, but whatever. Let's come over here. Anything else? Nope. Oh, my goodness. They really are attacking very ferociously. 
I'm glad I put the power arm over there, but they're, they're getting the crap beaten out of them. 32,000 manpower, 15,000 manpower. There's going to be a lot of guys, man. A load of guys. And Air Doctrine, actually. Let's finish that stuff up. I don't care about this air stuff. I really wish we could disable that. That's a, This is incredibly annoying to see all the time. I don't want to see this. I don't. I don't care. I really don't. Because we have only... Oh my god. Please stop showing this stuff. Please, please, please. They've got to be running out of equipment, right? How many of these are there? Holy crap! I clicked at least seven times. It's eight, nine, ten, eleven. Oh my goodness. If you want to about this, please go right ahead. Screw it, just go ahead. Move all in. We're not going to wait around for this. Go, force the attack. Force them to die. Force them, force them, force them to die. We're going to take all their energy cells as much as possible. They don't have a lot of planes right here. They have a lot of planes, but we have even more. They're losing 13 a day. That's nice. Oh, we just overran the division over here, too. That's pretty good, too. Um, they're going to pay the price for going to war with us. 11,000, they had 15. They're 32 down 29. We've got more than enough manpower to outlast them, so. Cool. Kill them all off. That's why I went savage leader with this guy. The bug chief. Go, go, go. Just gotta be brutal attacks on the entire front line. Absolutely insane. They've lost a little more manpower, which is nice. Dynamite's going down, which is good. I think they're out of planes. That's very good. Sophisticated robot tech. Awesome. Modern has land vehicles. Sure, I guess. Why not? Realm of Diana, huh? Not bad. Not bad. Keep going. Keep going. Local command chief, let's go and do some anti-aircraft protectors. Because we can. Oh, are you guys done? No, you ain't. No, you ain't. Oh, I bet supplies are actually really bad down here. I bet it's just god-awful. Get on over here, too, because we need your help. With... Just make sure your air is always in the air. Your air is always in the air. Well, that makes sense. <laughs> your, a your planes are always in the air. That's going to be super important. Get down here as well. Uh, do we have empty air? No, we probably do not. Supplies will probably be pretty bad down here too. Do that as well, it's fine. Hey, right, three more divisions go bye-bye. We all take it. Goodbye. Oh, it'd be good to cut these guys off too. We're about to go down here. Force it. Nice. Oh boy, we're trying to definitely push down here, but they... Our guys are going a little crazy, not going to lie. Please don't get... Oh, I just said don't get encircled, you pieces of garbage. Well, get some more soft attack. We ain't doing enough damage to them. Nice. Come over here, and actually we could probably upgrade our uh, special forces too, which would be good. Oh my god, please stop with that. Please, please, please. Stratified attack patterns are nice, but... Ooh... Keep going. At this point in the game, like, we're fighting huge enemies. Very strong. Everyone has had more than enough time to get enough strength up. But, with more of a struggle comes probably greater rewards. Cutting Desert Fox. We could do that. Urban Assault Specialists. Uh, this is for the general, so... Ooh. Actually, technically, because we got plus point one, you guys actually have a little bit of recon on you anyway. Point eight. Um, getting more recon. And Cutting Desert Fox. That'd be kind of cool. She should even do more damage now. How many divisions they have left? I can't imagine they have that many divisions. Two, oh, they started off 32,000. Now they got 2,000 left. 132 divisions, but it doesn't mean they're very strong. And they started off 15,000. Now they're 4,000. So, these guys definitely chose the wrong group to mess with. So, Oh my god. Stop with the air. Oh my god, please. There needs to be an option to disable that. There really needs to be. Guys, guys, guys. You got completely encircled here. Why? You're all the way... How? What the... My gosh. These divisions are just incredibly stupid. 
Why did you all get encircled? Either you win or these guys all die. So you have no choice but to win. And, and, oh my god. Jesus Christ. These guys are stupid. Oh, there goes the 80s. At least that's good for us. Because now we can rescue those guys over there, hopefully. Without losing too many guys. Wait, what? I'm not tributized. Game. You're spawning too many of these. They're just spawning too many. Please, let us disable this paradox. Why? I'm not going to give anybody anything. I'm just going to kill them all. Game. Give me the guy. Give me the guy. Wow, they really don't like us. Good thing we don't really like them either. Go, 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 go. Break them free. Let my people go. Oh, the Desert Rangers want to help us out. All right. Too bad we might end up killing them. Oh, well. You're not moving. Oh, do we actually, we actually got some supply. Some of these guys got supply. That's good. These guys are pathetic, though. Who is this general that led? Not the bug chief. It's this one. Smokey Brian? He's a real dummy dummy. No upgrades. And let the come on, power armor. You're not moving fast enough. You're really not. This is pathetic. Go, 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 go. Actually, we take Frisco City. We might just do it. Yep. There we go. That should be it. Pfft. Screw you, Sky Reavers. Screw you, man. Go suck a fat one. We do not negotiate with terrorists here. Not this time. Well, look at. Oh, hold on. He's got a special ability. I didn't even know that. Liberty Prime's got the eye lasers. Ooh. 200% offensive breakthrough? Nice. Got eye lasers? I love Liberty. Transport choppers? Nice. Now we go to those guys, get some better recovery, and let's go and grab some of that too. Last division of train. Attrition. Attrition. You ain't gonna come out like a cancer, no siree. Get some more reliability, that'd be good. Is that it? We're running out of things to do there. Okay, well, whatever. Alright, Washington, maybe? Get more scraps, always nice. 166 is quite a bit. Yeah, I did not expect to take out all of Utah in the second episode. Oh my god, stop it. Please, just stop it with that stuff. Uh, is there a way to disable this? I really want to know there's a way to disable this. It's so annoying to see it like 6,000 times. Literally, like, 200 times so far in this episode. Got game. Come on. I know you're slow. You're lagging hard. I understand, but still. Ace by that are promoted, and we'll do some of that too. Here's the research speed, but whatever. Go, 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 go. For some. Ooh. Look at this. How many how many do you want us to have spawned? Yeah, I get it that they're it's important to see that. Oh, we got aces, that's nice. But at this point in the game, I don't think anyone really cares, I'll be honest. Don't think a single person cares. Jester Randy, do that. Actually, I don't mind maybe up increasing this so we can Oh, we can already do this? Okay, that's good. Get some more general leaders. Approach is a little too that'd be good. And beloved leader, no, we want to go with. Let's go with that one. Why not? Get up to ten. That'd be kind of interesting. I never use that one. Might be useful. Might be very useful. With more factories, I'm not used to that. Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's do that. Make sure everyone's got enough stuff. Oh, we need more fighters. That's not good. Finally, we got him, my friends. So I'll do this off screen, but. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow as we'll continue expanding with New Columbia. Thanks for watching, have a great rest of your day.